Hi everyone, I'm Abigail. In our Bible story today, we meet a family that has just welcomed one of their sons back home. The father had two sons, and he set aside money for each of them to receive when they were older. The oldest son stayed with the father and helped to do work around the house and on the land. The younger one asked for his money early, left, and spent all of it on things he didn't really need. When he realized that he was out of money and needed help, he came home. He thought his dad would be really mad at him. Instead, his dad hugged him and threw a party. He was so happy to have his son back. It didn't matter what the son had done. The father wanted to celebrate that his son was back home because that was what mattered the most. Last year at church, one of our youth leaders had to go away on a trip for a while. We thought it would only be for a couple of months, but she ended up staying the whole year. I missed her so much. The community just didn't feel the same without her. After almost a year, she came back. Our pastor announced it with so much joy. The whole church cheered and we had a big party to welcome her home. Even though our church has many members, each of us makes a difference. It was important to celebrate that she came home and she was back with us. In God's kingdom, we all belong. No single person is more important than another. It doesn't matter who you are or who your family is. It doesn't matter what clothes you wear or what music you like. We all belong to God and to God's community. We all have choices to make and sometimes we won't all agree. The gift is that we celebrate one another and support our growth as a community. Even if someone leaves, we make sure they know they can always come back because it's God's community. We don't earn God's kingdom. We don't have to do anything special for it to exist because it already does. We all belong and it's important that we're each reminded of that. Remember, God always has a place for you to return to because God's love never runs out. Now, it's your turn to wonder.